New at 6, an audit released by the Orange County Comptroller exposes past potential flaws in hiring guards at the Orange County Jail. It reveals training fell short and requirements were not met by the security service paid to help protect the corrections facility. News 6's Laverne McGee is looking into the report and changes that have been made since. I spoke with Orange County Comptroller Phil Diamond this afternoon, who gave me the report and told me one of the reasons why he started this audit in the first place was for safety and security reasons. You want to make darn sure that guns aren't coming in, knives aren't coming in, drugs or contraband aren't coming in. So that that's something that wasn't done well enough. It wasn't done according to the contract. Security guards and officers not only keep jails and detention centers safe, they ultimately keep the community safe. But Diamond says that safety may have been compromised in the time period the Orange County Comptroller's Audit conducted their review of the security company hired to patrol Orange County Jail and the Orange County Juvenile Detention Center. That was between October 2021 through May 2022. The report says Allied Universal Security did not conduct proper training and hiring practices. Things like failing to copy driver's licenses of workers, failing to take employment history, and failing to enforce staffing requirements, including staffing a female guard at a juvenile detention center. Many applications were missing vital information, but the security personnel were still hired. Allied had a chance to respond, and in a letter dated January 11, 2023, Allied's Director of Operations writes, we regret to inform you that we fell short on maintaining current records, particularly those that should have been filed within our employee records. Diamond says they're giving them a chance to fix the problems and they will be following up to make sure they're in compliance. They may need to do additional training for their employees. They may need additional employees. They may need different employees. But whatever it is that needs to be done, they need to do it. It was also found that Allied Universal Security failed to administer physical and psychological evaluations. In one case, an employee did not get a psychological examination until 13 days after they were hired. The results showed the person needed further evaluation, and it was never done. You can imagine the bad things that could happen with a guard that failed the psychological exam working at the juvenile center, working in the jail. So I don't like it. I'm disappointed by it. Orange County has a $5.7 million contract with Allied. So who is to blame? Mayor Jerry Demings and the rest of the commissioners received the report this morning. Well, I think um, you can look at Orange County and you can point the finger in a number of directions, but you know, we focus on what needs to be done, what needs to be done to protect Orange County. Orange County Corrections issued the following statement. We appreciate the audit and its findings to strengthen operations. Monthly meetings are conducted to discuss and document concerns, opportunities and procedures. Operational changes are in place to address any immediate concerns and implement corrective action when needed. Laverne McGee, Getting Results, News 6.